Hello there everyone, this is Trussell242 and it's time for another episode of Animal Crossing. Good morning, Mayor Trussell. In Friholm it's Monday, March 30th, 2020 and the current time is 11.58am, yes. Well then, shall we get started? Yes, let's. Wonderful, let me get you set up. Alright, all set. Oh, but there is a small problem. Last time you left without saving your game. There's some of what you did last time may be gone. I'm very sorry about that. Please remember to save whenever you leave the game, okay? And here we go! Check out my awesome new house! Don't you love it? It's beautiful, I love it. Let's see what's in my mailbox. Ooh, mail with a gift. Fancy. Oh, and there's a butterfly just fluttering by. Let's read the mail, shall we? From my mom. Let's read it. Dear Trussell, I can't help but be a bit nervous about your first solo journey. Sorry about that everyone, I just had to pause a little bit since the uh, bells were so loud. I'm sending you something to help you along. I'll try not to worry, mom. Oh, that's so sweet. Let's take out the present. And let's open the present to see what she gave us. Some furniture. A modern wood chest. Wonderful. Wonderful. Our first bit of furniture for our new house. Let's see how it looks like. Oh, here we go with my green chair and everything. Isabel, sorry to intrude, Mayor. Aw, oh, what is it, Isabel? I see your house is all finished. Congratulations. The lumber smell from a new house is so nice, isn't it? That reminds me, I brought over some wallpaper to celebrate your new home. Here you go. Oh, she's so sweet. Thank you, Isabel. That's lovely. The paw print wall I just gave you is now in your pocket. Select it and choose hang on wall to change the room's wallpaper. You should try it when you get a chance. I hope you like the design. You can change your carpet as well by choosing spread on floor from your pockets. I hope you have fun redecorating your walls and floors with all the great designs out there. Oh dear, I forgot there's actually something else I need to tell you. When inside your house, you can press D-pad to change the camera angle in the room. Well, I won't be able to do that since I'm playing on an emulator, but thank you anyway, Isabel. You can also use it to zoom in and change your point of view. Did you already know that? Oh, and if you press the switch on the lower screen, you can make the entire room lighter or darker. Well, I can't do that either, but thank you, Isabel. Since it's your home, you should take time to enjoy it from each and every angle. Well, I'll be going now. Thanks for having me. Oh, that's the light switch, I see. I prefer the light on, I think it's much nicer. Now let's put up the paw print. Now let's display the modern wood chest. Oh, it's quite... it's not what I expected. It's a bit large and a bit unwieldy. Let's see if I can't. I need to move it a bit. I don't like the way it's... Come on, let me just try and... Oh dear. have it here and I can use it to store some of my items E, B and C very good let's close it and just have it there for now 
I'm not sure how to, if I press B maybe. Oh, it looks lovely. Wow, it's so beautiful. If I move my lantern a little bit. There we are. Then I should be able to pull it up against the wall like that. There we go. Now I'll simply push it. There we go. That looks a lot nicer. Now let's put the paw print wallpaper on the walls and see what that looks like. Okay, that's adorable and it makes sense that Isabel was the one to give it to us. I like the yellow color. Let's go outside and see what else there is to do during the day. Well, there's a flower that's definitely not looking so hot. It looks like it's dying. I think I'll need a watering can to water it though, so I shall be moving into town and get myself a watering can. Since apparently watering flowers helps with the citizens of Prova, which is very good. Since I need 100% in order to actually become the mayor. Well, let's go to the Nuckling Junction and ask them if they have a water. Oh no, but they haven't left. Welcome, welcome, come on in. Thank you, Tommy. Let's buy the net. 500 bells, yes, I'll take it. Do you know how to use this item? If you'd like, I can give you a quick explanation on how to use it. Please teach me. The net is just what it sounds like. It's a tool you use to catch bugs. You can't use it indoors though. When you're outside, equip it from your pocket or your When you see a bug, press A to swing your net to catch it. Well, that makes sense. If a bug is on a flower or a tree, it's helpful to hold down A while you sneak up on it, then bring it down. Some bugs can only be caught by the sneaking method, so stealthy. And he's got what looks like a baby's crib. And what's that? Oh, some wrapping paper. Uh, no thank you. I thought it was wallpaper. And he's got some... Uh, Letter writing paper. Oh, some goldfish paper, a fine item. Yes. Well, yes, I'll take a set. It's always good to write letters to your. Uh... Let's check out the wallpaper. Oh, a right platform. Oh. Ah, uh, no thanks. I thought it was the wallpaper display. It's a shame that we haven't got the watering can just yet. Thank you for visiting, come again. I feel like I really need it. Let's check out the Able Sisters store as well. Hello, welcome to the handmade fashion palace of the Able Sisters. Are you by any chance? Are you by any chance the new mayor everyone is talking about? Oh, everyone around town has been buzzing about you, so you were quite easy to recognize. As you can see, our store mostly specializes in handmade clothes. If you'd like accessories, please look at the accessory shop that's right next door. Well, let's see here what you have. You have a quite lovely white shirt here. Yeah? Ooh, but a plaid shirt. I wear a lot of plaid in real life. So I'm a big fan of this shirt. And I kind of like how this one looks as well. Let's see. The basic vibe of the red flannel shirt is nice, right? I'm a real fan. For 20 bells. Yes. Thank you. Yes, 420 bells. By the way, this is the first time you bought clothes here, right? This is a small store, but we still have new items every day, so please come back again soon. Wonderful. Um, hello there, you seem quite busy. 
I just can't let my clothes stray from all this work. I'm sorry. Hello, Sable. Hello, Mabel and Sable. Thanks, you come back now. I really like them. They're very sweet. They were in Wild World too. These two hedgehog sisters owning a shop together. Let's check out the accessories as well. Maybe I can find myself some glasses. Since I do wear glasses in real life. Label, hello! Well, you have some glasses. And you have some hats. I don't know, I guess these red glasses will have to do for now. The red glasses? That's not a bad choice. 140 bells. Well, I'd like to try it on, please. Okay, that's pretty cute. Wow, that cute look is great on you. What would you like to do? I'll take it. <laughs> yes, I've been shopping quite a lot recently. Oh, can you go between the shops like this? Or is this a changing room? Oh no, oh, you can go between the shops. That's wonderful. Thank you. Come back now. Oh, I will. Don't you worry about that. To check out Luke's homes to see. I think he's the one who sells wallpapers and floors and stuff. Welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness, Chasen. So good to see you. Hmm? Your home has now been built, yes? What do you think? Your house is now the stuff of dreams. Hmm? And now the number. I deducted your down payment, leaving a grand total of. 39,800 bells. That's the total amount of your paltry little loan. A mere trifle, really, yes? Hmm, oh no, you don't pay me directly. Please make all payments at the post office bell point. And there's no set schedule either. Pay the loan off at your own pace, whenever you're able, hmm? Yes, yes, one more thing. You do require that all homeowners become members of the Happy Home Academy, hmm? They just stop by from time to time and give your home an in-depth inspection. It's very good to get one. The inspection is a comprehensive look at your room and furniture level layout, your hygiene level, etc. If you're given high marks, you might even receive a wonderfully elegant commemorative prize. They'll schedule the inspection, so there's nothing for you to worry about at all. No worries at all, hmm? What else? Members, you see, also get gain access to the HA showcase behind the shopping district. Once you've received a letter that confirms your membership, you may visit the showcase at any time. Very good, please do come see me if you wish to discuss further renovations, hmm? Well, I don't really. I was just hoping to look if you have any wallpapers. But it appears you don't. Oh, maybe they have it in the second hand shop. Thanks so much. Thank you, Dominic. Well, let's go back to the village. And let's put on some clothes. Some nicer clothes. There we go. And then glasses. There we go. Wonderful. Hello there. How are you today? Nice weather, huh, Tarsa? Nice days put me in a nice mood, you know, a true. So did you need something? Let's talk. Oh hey, before I forget, I'd like you to see something. Ooh. You see my new outfit? I got it via mail order. What do you think? How well does it fit me? Really well. I like it a lot. Better than your other pink shirt. 
Oh, you think it looks that good? Haha, <laughs> that's what I thought. Cool, if you say it looks that good, I guess I'll just keep it on. Ah, I bought another outfit today. Here, you can have this. It's for, uh, uh, I know, it's your housewarming gift. Go ahead, put it on if you think it'll look good. You're the type who's okay with any type of clothing, right? Yeah? You're not? Well, that's not important. From your touch screen, open your pockets and select the green bar tea I gave you. Select where. You can change your clothes really easy this way, so get it. Wait, I'm not done yet, hold on. We have three shirt types. Shirts, tees and tanks. A.K.A. long sleeve, short sleeve, and no sleeve. Just a bit of knowledge for ya. Thank you. Let's see what does this chart look like. The green bar tee. Let's wear it. Oh, that's pretty nice as well. But I think I prefer the red flannel. Since I'm literally wearing a red flannel shirt in real life right now. I mean, you know, it's just appropriate. Let's shake some keys to see if we can get some money that way. No money, no money, no money. Some money, hooray! Let's pick it up. Let's just continue shaking the trees for a bit. Ooh, nice. Let's hope there are no wasps this time. Oh, and that's a present flying through the air on a balloon, as you can see, but you can only get them if you have a slingshot. Which I don't, so uh, yeah. I think I'll need to remove some of these dying plants. Oh, and there's a weed as well, I'll remove that too. What's that? The ladybug? Let's catch it. Yes, this will be fun. There we go! I caught the ladybug! Or is this one a man? I wonder what my encyclopedia says about my new catch. Yes, let's read it. Bugs, 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 ladybugs. They're found morning to evening in the spring. Wonderful. There we go. My first bug. Oh, hello, I think you're new, or do I already know you? Hello, Trussell. You seem cheaper as always. So what can I do for you? What's the latest? So Trestle, where did you decide to build your house? Over there. Well, around here. Oh, around here, huh? I'm glad you found a nice place, not me. Now that you've picked a place to live, I should send you a letter. I love writing letters. If it's not too much trouble, would you send me the occasional letter as well, Trestle? You can buy stationery at the store on Main Street. Once you've written a letter, take it to the post office. Then they deliver it. Oh, almost forgot. I'd like to show with my friends the letters I received. So please don't write anything that would embarrass me. And please don't write anything that would embarrass you. And let's say hello to this new... I think he's a new villager. Or is he? I think they are a new villager. Hello. Shadow. Hey, I haven't met you yet. I'm Shadder. I moved into town recently, but who are you? Wait, you're Trestle, right? Everyone says that you've had a ton of influence on this town. I'm impressed. Well, don't be a stranger, okay? I have a good feeling about you, Trestle. Hey, Trestle. I feel we need more dancing happening right now. 
Shoo. Okay, that's a little better. What's it doing? It feels kind of lonely since there aren't any events to celebrate, don't you think, Fromage? At times like this, you should plan your own fun event or so. For example, an interview with Chadder, or Chadder invites himself to your house. Oh, but uh, please don't plan anything like wake up prank on Chadder, I hate that event. Okay, so I can make my own events, that's interesting. Let's go and talk to Isabel, shall we? Hello, Isabel. Let's go sit in the new world. Hi, Mr. Mayor. Is there something I can help you with? Development permit. How is it going? You'd like to know how much progress you made towards getting the development permit? Yes, indeed. Well, you already own a house, and according to a recent survey, your approval rating is 58%. So all you need to do now is to gain the approval of the citizens. Hmm, let me think of a good way for you to gain their approval. Sorry, just having a bit of a drink there. Why not? Why not compose a new town tune for the town? Everybody loves a catchy jingle. Every time the citizens hear it, they'll think about you and how much you care about for you all. Just talk to me at the service counter to try your hand at composing a new town too. There you have it, if you follow that advice, you'll have a 100% approval rating in no time. Well, that's very good. Let's do that then. Hello, Mayor Russell. Is there something you'd like to inquire about? Um, how about a town tune? Well, the Freehold Town Tune plays in multiple places around town and serves to tell us what time it is. So it's essentially the uh, bell sound. Our current town tune is okay, but I always like change, so if you, if you have ideas for a new one, let me know. Even if you're not a musician, you should try to compose a theme that captures the essence of the whole. Um. Let's try this one. It's a bit of a mess, but... Allow me! Ahem! Oh my, what a wonderful theme! It's like music to my ears, literally. I didn't know she would sing it. That's adorable. I love it. I'll have to look up some new town tunes online. Some people are amazing at creating town tunes like this. And can make them out of popular songs. So I will see if I can find some good ones and choose them. Instead. It's like music to my ears, literally. I'm sure this will be a big hit with the townsfolk. We'll start using it right away. Oh, let's close and let us speak to her again. Hello, Mayor Trussell. Is there something you'd like to inquire about? What about the town flag? You want to know about Freeholm's flag? It's displayed in front of the town hall and inside the train station. Do you have a flag design that really captures the spirit of Freehold? Oh, um... Well, I like the bug one. Let's, let's have the bug flag for a little bit now. Town flag. I like it and I think it's cute. 
Maybe the biscuits. I think the stag beetle is better than the biscuits. Let's have this one. Wow! It's perfect! It really captures the spirit of Ridhol. I mean, since this is a very sort of nature-filled place at the moment, I figured it would make sense to have something of nature as the flag. It really captures the spirit of Ridhol. We'll use this to sign as a new town flag. Thank you for your excellent submission. It's no problem. It was so cute that she sang the town theme soon. That was adorable. I love that. Let's see, do we have any pears in the pear trees? Because I would like to sell some pears. Ooh, but there's a fossil in the ground, yes! Oh no, but there's a bee! Let's capture the bee! I caught a honeybee! What a sweet catch! There we go, and we look in the encyclopedia later. Now let's dig up this probable fossil. Yes, it's a fossil! Look, I dug up a fossil! Wonderful. Let's see, do we have any pears? No. That's a bit strange, I thought the pears would... Uh... Oh, here we have some pears. Oh, I need to... Do that. full already, should I swap it with something? Let's swap it with... Let's just drop it instead. Oh, and here's a weed, let's pull that out. It's very nice, the music that plays. I like it a lot. Hello, Chatter. Let's head to the second hand store. Oh, hello there, welcome. Yeah, you can hear the tune, it's, it's, it's a work in progress. Yes, can I help you? I want to sell. Well, I brought in all of these pairs. And start crunching the numbers right away. 600 pairs, sure thing. I like this red bed. What's this tool thing? Can you do anything with it? No. I like the red bed a lot. Oh, the common bed. This item belongs to Sally from here in Free Hall. 120 beds. Yes, I'll take it. Thank you for your purchase! Oh, that little thing means sold, I see. 
I see. Well, now I have a bed for my new mother. Thank you, come again. Let's go and give the... Well, put the... Bed inside my house. I think up against the wall there would be a nice place to put it, don't you? There we go, now I have a bed. That feels quite good. I think my house is becoming rather nice. And now let's go to the museum and hand in the fossil, as well as the insects, since Blathers collects bugs as well. Hello Serrano, you really seem to like walking around here, around the town plaza. I think you're pecan at least. Oh, Trussell, out chopping as well, chipmunk. What would you like to talk about, Trussell? Let's chat. When you have a limited number of bells, you have to be a careful shopper, unlike me. Oh, so she sort of impulse buys things. That's not very good. Let's head all over to the museum. Oh dear, pardon me. Welcome to the Freehold Museum. Hmm? Who, how may I be of service? I would like you to assess a fossil for me. What would you like me to assess? This fossil, please. Let me see. Hmm, well. Oh, hoo hoo! Eureka, yes, most certainly. It's a fern fossil. We don't have this fossil in our collection. Would you consider donating it, Russell? Donate it! Who wonderful! I'll add it to our collection. May I offer any further assistance? I would like to make a donation. I would like to donate this ladybug. Eat a bug! Uh, I beg your pardon, I just don't like handling these things much. Well, mm, ooh, a ladybug. This ladybug here reminds me vaguely of when I was but a chick in my mother's nest. Oh, I'm so sorry, I was about to get rather carried away there. No, continue, brothers, I'm curious. What was your little childhood memory about? Anywho, I promise we'll take good care of this critter. We'll display it later with a more detailed description, so please come back to see it. Thank you very much. May I offer any further assistance? Yes, I would like to donate another bug. Sorry for this. Sorry for this, I know you hate bugs, but maybe this honeybee won't be so bad. Eat the bug! I beg your pardon. I just don't like handling these things much. Well, hmm, who who a honeybee? This, oh. Do every bug remind him of his childhood? That's interesting. I promise we will take good care of this critter. We will display it later with a more detailed description, so please come back to see it. Thank you very much. May I offer any further assistance? Ah, uh, nothing. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. Well, here we are then. The 
Let's go to my house and put some stuff in storage. Oh, there's a fish here. Maybe I should try some fishing. Oh, he's got a watering can, but I haven't. That's unfair. Don't like that. No, no. Oh, come on, little fish. Oh, well, now it swims over there. Brilliant. Hello, fishy fishy. Oh, and I did it again. Typical. I'm not very good at catching fish. Let's go over to the beach and see if there are some seashells we can get. We can get. And here's another bee. I'm much better at catching insects. So let's do that instead. Yes, indeed. Oh, did it fail? No, it's a ladybug. Let's catch it nonetheless. I caught a ladybug. Wonderful. Let's... Oh, I need to... Shell. Tower shell. Dude, I think those are quite valuable along with corals. Oh, I'm standing on the. Let's see. There's a big old fish over there. Let's see if we can catch him. Come on, fishy fishy. Oh, come on. Oh, there's another one, a big one. Ah! Mm. Darn it, I did it again. Oh, and again. I'm so silly. And I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Let's pick up the ball. Wait, no, it wasn't the coral, it was just my glasses. In from the back, I see. <laughs> Silly me. Never mind. Let's just drop this seashell. And let's head on back to the... second home shop. Ooh, what's this? Oh, um, Let's see, do I have anything that I could... Well, I can write these letters. I can write one to Sally. Let's just write a simple short letter. Let's write to um, Ms. Ramu, I guess. Let's write to Pecan, I like Pecan. And let's write to Tucker. There we go. 
No, I want that butterfly. Oh no, it fluttered away. No, it didn't. Oh, let's just try and... Oh, no, it did. Oh, come on. But let's see, who's going to live here? Oh, I need to... Um... Gabby's new home, did you say? Yes, Gabby's new home. So we're getting new villagers, which is good. And this is Chadwick's new home, I think. I think that's where Chadwick lives. Unless he lives over here in this yellow house. He probably does. Can I go inside? Nope, Chadder is wandering for a bit outside. Well, that makes sense. I'm not sure if I like him. I don't. I think that a mouse made out of cheese is a bit suspicious. Hello there, welcome. Thank you, Reese. Can I help you? I would like to sell. So you can have all of these, as well as this ladybug. Okay, 930 bells, that's fine. Oh, would you like to put something up in the flea market space? I would. I think I'd like to sell this MVP t-shirt. I don't really like it. Okay. Yes, I would like to sell it. For how much? No, it's... Right then, I've put a price tag of 200 bells on this item. I hope we can find it a new one. Okay, so if it sells, it goes to the new recipient straight away and she will put the money into my savings account. Hello, Sally. Are you hoping to buy something or are you selling? Either way, good luck. Thank you. I hope you find something as well. Thank you, come again. Let's go to the post office and mail those letters. Oh, there's a butterfly. Maybe I can catch it. Well, it flies about over the water. The oh, one here is... Uh, who are you again? But Hey, it's our son. Are you training today, partner? No slacking, okay? I'm watching you. So what's up, bro? Let's talk. Have you read the bulletin board yet today? Not yet. You should check it out soon. It's kind of important. Yeah, I make a habit of stopping by the bulletin board on my daily run past the train station. By the way, sometimes birds sit on the top of the bulletin board. Have you noticed that at least? It's a sign that there's a new message to read. I don't understand why it works like that, but it does, partner. Well, okay then. Let's check it out. Oh, and there's a fossil there, I think. Is there a new message? No. Let's dig up this fossil. <laughs> and let's just take a little screenshot, shall we? we dig up a fossil. Well, here we are then, let's just... Put the dark back into the hole. I think everyone is out walking today. Yeah? 
but I've made at least a little bit of money, so I feel quite happy with myself. With that. Oh, and there's another fossil. Wonderful. Look, I dug up a fossil. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Let's just remove the shovel. And then go up and give them to bladders to see what they are. Oh dear, pardon me. Welcome to the Freehold Museum. How may I be of service? I would like you to assess a fossil. This one, please. Oh my, it's most certainly a T-Rex skull. Wow! Would you consider donating it? Yes, please. Have it. Wonderful, I'll add it to our collection. You have my thanks. Who, if only we had the other pieces, this fine creature would be complete. You may offer any further assistance. Yes, please assess a fossil for me. What would you like me to assess? This fossil, thank you. Let me just see here. Mm, well, oh, oh, oh my, upon examination, it's most certainly a Triceratops. Yes, would love to donate it. Here you go. I'll add it to our collection. No, you may not offer any further assistance. Mm, well, there we are, then. I just wish I had a watering can. Let's go talk to Isabel to see if there's anything else we can do to help make people in this town happy. Hello Isabel. Is there something you'd like to inquire about? What about citizen satisfaction? How satisfied are they? Here is what the Citizen Satisfaction Committee had to say. Oh, yes, the same thing. Yes, yes. Freehold has a good balance between natural areas and developed areas. However, citizens still think the town feels a bit barren overall, so additional development is desired. Well, I can't develop anything at the moment. How is my approval rating going? Hi, Mr. Mayor, is there something I could help you with? Development permit. 73%, that's wonderful. How can I gain their approval? How about pulling up any weeds around town? After all, nobody likes weeds. Just keep an eye out for them while you're strolling around town and pull up any you see. Easy peasy. There you have it, if you follow that advice, you'll have a 100% approval rating in no time. Well, I'm sure I just need to, you know, gather up some bells and do some other such kind of things. But oh yes, before I forget, the post office. I need to go to the post office and 
send those letters. And I think that will help my citizen approval rating as well. I mean, the, I know that the villagers all like it when you give them letters, so why not just send some letters away? Hello, Pelly. Welcome to the Freeholm Post Office. What can I help you with today? I would like you to send some mail. Who would you like to send your mail to? Some people in Freeholm. Just drop anything you want to send into the red box. Well, brilliant. I'll do that. Just wait. Here we go. Alright, I'll send this mail off as once. Thanks for choosing the Freeholm Post Office. Wonderful. And let's see if we can't do a little bit of a pay on the loan. Welcome, please select from the following options. Repay loan, yes, I would like to repay them. No. There we go. There we go, and then I can pay it with a thousand bells at a time. Or you know more, depending on how many bells I manage to make. By the way, I heard something that's quite interesting if it's true. I'm not sure if it is, but I hope it is. And it's this. If you plant some bells in the ground, Just like this, you dig a hole. Then you take out some bells. Let's take out 100 bells. And then you bury it in the hole. You can get a money tree. I'm not sure if it's true, but... You know, it's interesting to check it out at least. Hold on you, butterfly. I want to catch you. Let's catch some seashells instead. I love that your character leaves with your footprints. Oh, and there's the bird. There's the bird. Let's catch you as well. Little butterfly. And, ah, uh, come on, come on, come on. Ah, uh huh. Gotcha! I caught a yellow butterfly! Now to catch a toast fly. Let's take a little screenshot of this as well. There we go. Very nice. Did you know that in Alice in Wonderland, there's a chapter where Alice meets flowers in the garden, and she also meets a bread and butterfly? Because the writer, Lewis Carroll, is very fond of puns. And the entire book is basically just filled with little jokes like that. And I'm still terrible at the fishing. But now I have some stuff I can sell at the second hand shop at least. And just earn a little bit more money for that loan. Ooh, the wind is blowing. Let's head on. Hello there. Welcome. Thank you. Can I help you? I would like to sell. I mean, it's not much, but it's something. Oh, I don't want to sell my net. No, no, no. And I don't want to sell the butterfly. Because that's going to the museum. Okay, um... 817 bells. Yes, that sounds good. I wonder 
wonder what that thing is. Oh, the bow. Oh, it's a bow. Oh, uh, no. No, thank you. I like the plant. Thank you. Come again. Let's go to the museum and give Blathers the jello butterfly. I know he doesn't like butterflies, but you know. Sometimes you just have to do these things. And I would like to fill out the museum before I do anything else. Well, I mean, I would like to pay off my loan as well, but you know, filling out the museum is also an important part. Hello, blathers. <laughs> I'd like to make a donation. This bug, please. There you go. Yes, indeed. We'll display it later. Thank you very much. May I offer any further assistance? No, thank you. There we go. We can view it over here if we would like. Oh, and they. Oh, oh, this is very sweet. Oh, and there you can see the yellow butterflies fluttering around. Yellow butterfly. March 30th, donation by Trussell. Yes. The yellow butterfly is similar to the common butterfly, with the two easily mistaken for one another. Males are more often a yellowish color and females are more often white. The larvae feed on plants of the Fabaceae family, such as milk vetch or white clover. I mean, this is quite lovely. It's like a little, well, a little butterfly garden. I, I, I like this. I think this is great. And there's a little pond. This is so cute. I'm a big fan. And there's the bee as well. Feeding on some more flowers. And the ladybug. That's wonderful. This museum is so cute. I approve a lot. And I found the music in the museum to be so peaceful. Don't you? Anyway, having done a bit of this and that, I do believe it is time for me to end this episode. Thank you all so much for watching, I hope you have a wonderful day, take care now, and please tell me in the comments how you would like this Animal Crossing series to be scheduled. Would you like to have it as it is now, as bonus episodes? Would you like to have it weekly, daily? Yes, tell me. Anyway. Have a good day everyone, take care, bye!